Ibig sabihin, yung total ng lahat, kasama si X. Andiyan na naman si X. <laughs> total lahat ng angles dito ay 540. Okay, this is our topic. Finding the measure of an interior angle. So, we will find the measure of an interior angle. Interior angle, ibig sabihin yung nasa loob ng polygon. Okay? So, let's have the first example. What is the measure of the uh, fifth angle of the pentagon? Okay? So, this is the pentagon. Ibig sabihin ng pentagon, meron siyang limang sides. Okay? So, yung given natin dito, okay? Sulat muna natin yung mga given Merong X, andyan na naman si X Okay Merong 100 degree This is right angle, ibig sabihin this is 90 degree And another right angle, 90 degree pa rin yan And this is 120 Okay, merong apat na sides lahat yan ha So, hanapin natin itong uh, peak angle mamaya Okay First, of course, we have to find the total or the sum of measures of the interior angle. Kukunin muna natin lahat ng measure dito sa interior angle. Okay? Yung sum of the measure of the measure of interior angle. Okay? Interior angle. So, yung sum niya Dapat dito ko muna ilagay pero wala na space dyan. Dito muna ha. So, yung sum niya, that is, ay uh, yung formula niya, ito na lang, kaya pa pala. N minus 2 times 180. So, this is the formula of finding the sum of the uh, measure of interior angle. Measures. N minus 2 times 180 okay then we all know that the polygon is a pentagon ibig sabihin meron yang five sides or it is a five sided polygon okay so yung n natin dito is five ibig sabihin yung number of sides so five kasi pentagon five sides minus two times Eh, ano ba yan? 180 Okay? Times yan ha? So, 5 minus 2 That is 3 Times 180 So, ito, i-multiply natin yan Si 3 times 180 Okay? 180 times 3 0, 24 2 3 times 1 3 plus 2, 5 So, 540 540, ano yan? Yung sum of measures of angles in the interior angle. Okay? Sum of the measures of interior angle. Okay? Ibig sabihin, yung total ng lahat, kasama si X. Andyan na naman si X. <laughs> total lahat ng angles dito ay 540. Okay? So, we will now find the pip angle. Anong measure yan ngayon? O ano ang value ng X? May value pa ba si X? <laughs> okay, we will solve or we will find the fifth angle or we will find the X. Ito talaga si X kahit X na hinahanap pa. <laughs> okay, so we will solve for X. So yung, yung uh, given natin ganina, si... Uh, X plus 100 plus dalawang 90 so plus 90 plus 120 equals 540 okay, kasi 540 yung total niyang uh, angles yung sum niya sum of the measures of angles okay, 540 na, kalandrakas na okay, ngayon Kupihan natin si X Okay, then itong lahat ng to Ay i-add natin 
100 plus 90 plus 90, this is 280. Plus 120, this is 400. So, plus 400 equals 540. Okay? And then, i-apply natin yung nanalaman natin last topic na mag-subtract tayo or mag-add tayo ng negative ng negative 400. Or mag-subtract na lang tayo ha. We have to apply the subtraction property of equality. So, x plus 400. Mag-subtract tayo dito sa left side ng 400. Equals 540. Mag-subtract din tayo sa right side ng 400. Okay? Kung ano yung i-subtract mo dito sa left, ganun din dito sa right. So, ang naiwan dito, x na lang. Ayan na si x mo. Okay? So, X na lang kasi i-cancel natin yan 400 minus 400 That is 0 So X na lang yung naiwan So 540 Wala na talaga akong space Okay Minus 400 So 041 Or 140 degree so, Ang value ng X pala ay 140 degree Okay, so therefore, yung measure of the pit angle or x is 140. So this is your final answer. Next, we have number two. So find the value of x. Yan na naman si x. So this is the polygon. Okay, this is a quadrilateral. Meron siyang apat na sides. Okay? So, first, we have to find the sum of measures of interior angle. Okay? Merong apat na sides yan, di ba? So, yung, yung given natin dyan, yung given natin is 60 x x, meron tatlong x. Grabe naman to si x. Tatlo na. Tatlo ba yung mga x nyo? <laughs> Okay, tuloy natin ha. Ito talaga si X. Nawawala na ako. Okay, so kunin natin yung sum ng uh, lahat ng angles. Okay, so sum of measures of interior angle. Okay, equals N minus 2 times 180. Pwede lang uh, close and open. Pwede ring that represent the multiplication. So, equals N is the number of sides So, this is 4-sided polygon Ibig sabihin, 4 minus 2 times 180 Okay? So, equals 4 minus 2, that is 2 times 180 Therefore, yung total ng lahat ng angles ay 360 degrees Okay. Ngayon, we have to find the value of x. Okay, so kunin natin yung value of x. So, x plus x plus x equals, ay, napay may 60 pa pala, sorry. Plus 60 equals 360. Saan galing to? Dito sa total, uh, to, uh, sa sum of measures of Interior angle Okay So X plus X plus X That is 3X Plus 60 Equals 360 Okay Ngayon Merong 60 na yung na Nandyan di ba So mag-apply naman tayo Ng subtraction property Of equality So 3X plus 60 Mag-subtract tayo Ng 60 dito sa left Dito rin sa right 360 Kopyahin natin yan mag-subtract din tayo ng 60 sa right. Okay? So, 3x equals yung 60, cancel na yan. 60 minus 60, that is 0. So, ang naiwan, 3x. So, 360 minus 60, that is 1. Ay, 100. Ako na una, makautok eh. Is 300. Okay. So, 300. Ngayon, dito tayo sa taas ha, konti. 3x equals 300, di ba? 
So we have to apply division property of equality. We have to divide both sides, okay, by the coefficient of x. The coefficient of x is 3. So 3x equals 300. So over 3, or mag-divide tayo ng 3 sa left side, mag-divide din tayo ng 3 sa right side. Okay? Ang naiwan dito, i-cancel natin yung 3, ang naiwan si x na lang. x mo. <laughs> equals 300 divided by 3 is 100. Therefore, the value of x is 100. Okay? So, lahat ng uh, value ng x ay 100. 100, 100, 100. So, 300 lahat yan, di ba? Ng x, i-add mo yan si 60, that is 360. Kung itutal natin yan lahat. At maraming maraming salamat sa panonood At kung hindi ka pa nakapag-subscribe sa channel ko, mag-subscribe ka na. At hit mo yung notification bell para updated ka sa lahat ng mga videos na i ko. See you to my next video. Bye-bye!